Hello! How is everyone today? Welcome to Dogwood Paper Arts. This is Angela Toma. Good to see you all. So I'm working on Marguerite Miller and this is 2022 Planner 14. Um, I think it's CWP 14 is what they do with it. Um, anyway, I have to look at it before I post it. I need a ribbon a plant, a person in whichever form, splashes or splotches, sheet music, and bonus is a sewing pattern. So I have my background of music paper. Music, please. And we are going to put on here... Um, We might put some things around the edges. Don't know yet. So I am going to do a first communion scene. I'm sorry about the glossy here. It gets very bright and shiny because I put it on glossy paper. Um, but I'm going to cut it down a bit. I just thought it would look pretty back there. in the background. Let's flip it over this way. I guess it's okay if it's a little small, huh? Because we're going to take up some of the space anyway. Oh yeah, we need to make it smaller because we want our music sheets to show. So let's take it right to this black line here. Now we have some extra windows if we need them. And we'll take it right over to this one. This didn't give me a very good printout, but then I just got it from the web, that's why. Okay. So let's go ahead and push it clear up to the top. So that was what I wondered if I was going to need some edging around up there. I guess not. You know, collages can be um, different areas of the paper. And then I have this church bench here. It did not print out very well, but that's okay. People are going to be sitting on it as soon as I cut it out. There's a bench behind it, but I didn't have anybody, I couldn't squeeze anybody in on that one. Actually, I don't think it looks right with the one behind it, so I think I'll take that off. It doesn't really matter. wanted to get one of the old church pews and put out on my walkway. Okay, so there's our church pew. Have a cross. And then we might have to make it a little bit shorter. We have mom and dad sitting there. And the one little girl is going to be sitting because she's was sitting with mom. Sitting by mom. There we go. This is her veil. I have to attach it to her head. And here's the other little girl. And 
Anyway, somehow I'll attach that and she's going to be standing by the pew. Okay, by the church pew. So let's start by gluing this piece down in the back. Now that we have, now that we are partially set up here. <laughs> Uh, does not want to come out. Here we go. I don't know how this will take the glue on it. Hopefully it will be fine. Okay, I'm going to run that right up to the top of the page. Oh, it's a little slippery, guys. It's a glossy picture. <laughs> it makes it hard to run your hand across it. Okay. Now let's put in the church pew. We're getting somewhere already. I think we'll put it maybe over this way. No, I'm going to center it a little bit. Towel. Oh goodness, I tried to rub a hole in the church pool. Okay, let's see. Now, this piece. I'm going to do like that a little bit. I'm going to go this way a little bit. Just kind of rounding it off a little bit. Um, I want to have some little pieces in it that fold. I guess I could have um, put some thread through it. I probably would have done it. But let's flip her over here. Come here, sweetie. On the back of her head, we're just going to place this like this. I'd like to be able to put it up over her head, but that won't work. But if I fold it under a little bit and then bring this back down. Oh yeah, look, we've got some sticking up there now. That's good. Yay! Okay. going to stand her right here by the pew, by the church bench. Oh, look, we got to take that piece out of our arm there. I thought I got them all. I did not. Sorry, I got to press you down a little bit. We got to get your 
down to your well, it's not going to work. Okay, fine. Now we'll have to put this on top of this, I guess. There we go. Now it should work. <laughs> when you want something to stick down, it won't. When you don't want something to stick down, it will. Hey. I don't know why that doesn't want to stick down. It should. It shouldn't make a difference. Okay. Well, we're going to leave it like that. I mean, I would kind of like to bring this like over like that or something. Because I imagine that, like, when my little girls, they just pulled their veils kind of around them, and they loved it. There we go. That worked a little bit. And she's got her hand out over here, so we know that she won't be pulling it around on that side. Okay, let's put Mom and Dad in next because she's going to sit beside them. So let's put them right here. Okay, <laughs> it's kind of sticky with the tum glossy picture in the background. Round her foot. Round his feet. Gosh, I miss wearing high heels. <laughs> oh, goodness. I always loved them. Love, love, love. Okay. Sit them on the bench. Does it look like they're sitting on the bench? There we go. I was going to center them, but they want to sit closer to the, all their kids. They want to be close to all of them because they're getting a picture taken. And when you're getting your picture taken, you better be ready. Bunch it up a little bit in the back. Like this. Like so. Oh gosh. 
help. I need three hands. Let's flip her over. I don't want to touch her face or anything right now with all this glue on my hands. Okay. Her veil is not quite as large as the other one. Okay. So what we're going to do is the same thing. We're going to lay it this way. <laughs> and try to get it glued on there. Like that. Like that. Okay. I got that part. Now let's see if we can glue the veil down to here. Goodness, I got fuzzy stuck all over me. And then Okay. She's going to sit down next to Mama. How cute. Oh, how sweet. Okay. Boy, I got glue going everywhere, you guys. Got some on her forehead. That won't do. Okay. Whew. Just gotta remember, don't close this book. <laughs> okay. So I have these little white flowers, and I want to put them. Oh, I have some little pink ones too. I might put those in the center. Okay, I'm going to put these here with the veil. Oops. Well, boy, that doesn't want to stick at all. Where'd the other one? Oh, there it is. Whew. Always losing stuff on my table. I wonder why it's... Maybe because it's not at all clean? <laughs> That's probably it. So I just wanted that to be a part of the veil. There we go. Sticks down a little bit better as it starts to dry. So that's good. Okay, now. I wonder if we can call that our ribbon. I mean, it's kind of like a ribbon, isn't it? I don't want to put a whole thing down there. Um, I do have some ribbon behind me, but I think none of it will be the right color. Um, 
Yeah, none of that's the right color for a religious thing. I think we'll just call that our ribbon. Let's see, let's recycle. Um, oh, we need some pattern. We might come back with some ribbon. We'll see. Okay, I have some pattern paper. These are how the old patterns are. They just came like this, I guess. And they came with letters in them. So, I don't know. What shall we do with that? Put the floor down? Sure, why not? Let's do that. Sorry about the glue noise. Motorcycles outside. Yes, yes, yes. And there. Could that be a rose? No, that can't be a rose. But maybe that could be a flower. Why not? Let's make a flower. We're going to put some glue on it. And stick it down. Put our hand in the middle of there, our finger. I mean, otherwise, I don't really know what to do with the pattern paper. And then we'll find a piece of maybe pink this time. I do have some of this out because I've um, been using it in the journal. These are smaller. That would have looked better. But usually with your First Communion, it's all white. So I didn't want to put any other color in there that didn't belong. Okay. So there's one flower. Wrong size. Why my finger itches? Okay. So we'll go here. I don't know. I'm just doing squish flowers. My daughter's indoor cat got out last night somehow. They were so glad to find him. They just love him to pieces. He's a great big old silly guy. For a kitty. You know, cats sometimes are very funny. But he really is, and he's such a baby. But he's huge. Huge, huge, huge. 
but I don't know. He did not like being outside. They did finally find him in the backyard, and he was so glad to be in. He had to be on his guard all night, you know, in case a dog came around or something. Oh, poor guy. Okay, so we have a couple little flowers there. Um, these patterns are so different without the um, all the lines on them and stuff. You do have, um, you know, this part. Okay, I'm going to just set that back there for now. And, and we need some plants. I did find some. So, let's see. We have this. Two. We have two of them. Yeah, yes. And let's put those right here. Okay. And then we have this one. So let's put it over here by this little girl. Because she likes flowers too. And then we have this one. So these are the plants I'm using, by the way. We have that one. And I really kind of like this one with the rose in it, but I don't want that hanging. This hanging one, because that would look silly sitting on the floor, wouldn't it? I guess some could go back here. No. I'm going to put this one over here. Next to that one. Okay. And then we have this other one. Right here. We're going to place right over here. So I don't know if I'm collaging or if I'm just making pictures. I guess I'm collaging a picture. Um, you know, you sometimes get what you get, I guess. So I don't like that that one doesn't show up very well. Perhaps this one needs to go there. Maybe like that. I know. Maybe here. No. Oh, we'll put it down here. We can move her veil a little bit over. Like this. And that would probably help, but it's okay. If somebody wants to see what the flowers are like, they can move her veil. Okay, so we have music. Okay, here is this pink ribbon. It is the wrong color to use in my um, the wrong color to use in my thing that I'm, I'm making. 
journal. So let's put this here. Okay, we'll just put it there. We don't need everything lined up perfect, do we? So there's a little bit of ribbon there. Perhaps we'll put a little ribbon under here. Why not? Flowers would like to have a little bit of ribbon, I guess. Okay. And then what? What else did I bring? Not that. Oh. Um, we have our plant. What else do we need? Splashes or splotches? We have person, we have ribbon. We need splashes or splotches. But I brought this too because I'm trying to use up all my stickers because they just take up space. This is going to be glossy. Give thanks to the Lord for he is good. Each day is a gift to be opened with prayer. Now I like this because it matches this. So I'm going to put that one on. Where should we put it? Right with the ribbon? Why not? Let's do. Ooh, my husband must make dinner. Or must be making dinner. There we go. We're just going to put that right on top of the ribbon. Cool. I like it. And then, um, I think I'd like to put this little cross up on the wall. It's not really a Stations of the Cross, but hey, we can have some and pretend like throw a station to the cross. And here's another one. And we'll put it over here. Okay. And then we have this pretty one with the little diamond guy in it. And we'll put it over here, like this. All right. Now, let me grab my watercolors. Because we need some splashes. Oh, well, we don't have to use watercolor. Um, pink. Oh dear, what color should we use? Speckled egg? Um, we have sponge sugar. Vintage linen. That's what we have. We're going to use it. And fan brush. 
sorry, this is taking a little bit of extra time here. Didn't think about getting out a fan brush because I didn't think I would need one. Well, we're just going to use our little brush. And just like before, because my paint brushes, my water brushes are still in the other. Um, the other room. So I'm just going to put a little water in there and push this to the back because I don't want to knock it over or anything. Oh, I haven't opened this one yet. Quick way to open them. Maybe. No, I'm not cutting off the top. I'm unscrewing the top. So I'm just going to set that there. Have I already lost my brush? <laughs> okay, let's practice on this paper. Perfect. Okay. We need to cover up the family because we don't want the family to get wet. Let's cover them with this. Don't look, I'm going to cut it. Crossing our fingers. So this is distressing ink in the linen linen. I thought that might look best. Getting it all over everywhere. Okay. Ta da! Some splashes. Not many, but we've got them. That's all we needed. And then, what else? Okay. We have this word hope. So let's use it too. I'm going to put the cap back on that stuff. And I think we'll put it right up here. And what else do we have? Oh, there's a I already got those. Little purses, little gloves. Let's give the little girl some gloves. Right here. There's her little gloves. I don't like that sticker behind them. Maybe we could set them on the pew here. 
like this. Just like that. I think I'll see if I can take this off the back. Yeah. I like that better. Where's the other one? That dot just did not look right back there. Okay, a little bit of Fabri-Tac. And we'll set this on the, the bench here. And then we'll set this one on. Is dinner ready? About two and a half minutes. Okay. I'll be done. Well, you guys heard the boss. I gotta go. It's time for food. So there's her gloves. And is there something else? We have it all. So I think we'll call it good. We probably should have our... Um, our chalice in there though. Because you can't do First Communion without a chalice. And I think there's actually some hosts in here. sister. There. Okay. So there we go. Those watches are not crying at all. But they look okay. All right, so there we go. That is our challenge all done for today. I am going to leave this sitting because it needs to dry. So we have a ribbon under here, a plant, lots of them. They're not really plants, but they're flowers. We have some people. We have splashes and splotches and music sheets. And we have our bonus piece, our pattern. Okay. Oh, oh my. That gets kind of... Let's see if I can pull you up a little closer to see it. There they are. We have our church window. I'll turn that down just... No, it doesn't work that way, does it? Sorry. And then down below we have more stuff. Yeah, let me do it this way. We have our flowers and our ribbon in my hand. Um, we have the girls and their parents. We have our hosts and our chalice. And there we go. We have done it again. Thank you for joining me and for helping me out. Let me move this back. There, that helps a little bit, doesn't it? All right, I will see you tomorrow. Don't forget, give this video a thumbs up and um, subscribe to my channel. And I will talk to you later. Bye.